And the flood. Interesting 90 minutes ahead of us here. Paris Saint-Germain get things started. Verratti. Well taken away. He won the ball. Well, they couldn't keep it. Verratti Hakimi and still danger here Karim Benzema who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him here? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet. And gets oh, Stuart, shot. they could be in here, in position, and denied by the keeper. Impressive. Benzema. Benzema. The ball with Luka Modric. Are showing good patience. Can he get them in front? Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. And fired over by Kors. Well, he failed to get it away properly. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And a goal kick given. Vitor Ferreira on to Messi now what can Paris Saint-Germain do from this position what a big chance that was keeper has the ball Lionel Messi Able to skip past his man. Verratti. Mbappe! Yeah. 
Crossing possibilities. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. And the ball is moving again, and the question is, how will PSG reply to that setback? Mbappe, Ferreira, good movement, well disappointing end to the move, Modric, well there you can see Real Madrid haven't been able to control possession but what they've done with it has been really good and they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment, they love to play on the counter-attack. It's really good without the ball, and the all-around performance levels have been high. A really sumptuous ball, and diving to thwart him. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. And a bit short with the clearance. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Hakimi. Messi. This could square the game. But the keeper has his say. And how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. Casemiro lost the ball. And it's Messi going forward. What's he going to do next? Gives it a go. And the PSG corner. Fired in by Neymar, and still dangerous. Mbappe, Mbappe! Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out any sign of danger. He's driven in the corner. Oh, super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task. Another corner. The delivery from Neymar. Can he finish here? Well, I don't think that effort remotely qualifies as respectable. And the reason it's off target, because the technique was really poor on that occasion. That's not a good effort. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital.
Well, usually a standout and was in the first half, Luka Modric. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. A potentially exciting match in store, and it's Paris Saint-Germain who kick off. The ball moving again. Real have the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. But here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play, offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Mbappe. Well, really, making the goalkeeper's life simple. That should be hit in the back of the net. That was a big, big chance. Careless in possession. Verratti. Verratti! Well, decent save there. Fancy a short one. Marquinhos. Well, the chance has been missed. No other way to describe it. Tony Kroos. Karim Benzema. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. A goal here! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So on they go again, and every indication that Real are going to stroll to victory here. Kylian Mbappe. Well, racing past his man. A mischievous effort. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. Tony Kroos, Modric. Unable to keep the ball.
Vinicius Junior. Takes the shot. Oh, a smart stop. Cross with the corner. Well, still an issue here. Cross. Will it be? Well, a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. And Neymar, the goal scored by Kylian Mbappe. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Modric. Real find themselves in a position of menace. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Tony Kors. Delightful pass. Is it going to be? Just cleared away in the nick of time. Well, close to the end of this contest and Real Madrid absolutely cruising. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. Benzema and back with Kroos Vinicius can he finish able to clear the danger corner kick though here PSG have decided to make a double substitution there following the cross and not cleared away properly look at Modric here's Renato Sanchez Messi Mbappe and a good tackle so there goes the final whistle. Real Madrid victorious, and their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Luka Modric tends to bring a calm authority to any game. How would you sum up what he produced? Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is. Interesting 90 minutes ahead of us here. Paris Saint-Germain get things started. Crossing possibilities. 